Hey guys, welcome back to Fallout 3. In this episode, we are going to storm in Paradise Falls and shoot the crap out of everybody. Alright, I'm gonna eat some food and make my tummy all nice and full before I go in here and kill people. Don't want to shoot people that are bad on an empty stomach, I guess. If you want to look at it like that. So, yeah, wish me luck or I'm gonna die. Yay! Hopefully not, but we'll try it. Like, oh my god. Now, it's very important for you to watch your health if you didn't already figure that out. Because, um, you die very easily if you're not careful. Oh, car's on fire. Car's on fire! Run! Run! Mm. Look at that. 7 HP. 7 HP. Oh. He got blown up. There's actually a guy with a minigun up here, so you might want to take him out. Reloading. This is why I went to Rivet City. Get more ammo for my miniguns. I can mow people down. That has a pretty good tactic, kind of just going around the top square there. It's a pretty good tactic, like it really works for him. You're done. Yeah, I don't mean that's how we do it. I'm actually going to start picking up a few guns because, you know, you can always go and sell them, you know, they're always nice. You can never go wrong with ammo and missile launcher to repair your other missile launcher, you know. Can't go wrong with that. And combat shotgun to repair your other combat shotgun, you know. Not bad at all. See, I'm gaining karma from this, so that's a good thing, as you can probably tell. Well, that was like a no-brainer. Why did I even say that? It's obvious good karma's good. <coughs> now, the coincidence with this Chinese assault rifle is if you, um, if you actually help these guys out and, you know, get them slaves and all that stuff, like, there's a guy back here, like, at the beginning of that building over here. You can go in there, and it's like their army... It's like their, uh... What do you want to call it? Their weapon supply area. Their... Their weapon... Ammunition store. Whatever you want to call it. And they want, like, Chinese assault rifles. And you can make a good bit of money from doing it, actually. I'm actually taking out these guys pretty well. I'm actually kind of shocked. Like, this is this is going pretty well for me right now. Like, I thought it was going to be, like, total opposite. It's actually working out. I 
believe that's it. So, um, just come in here. Open up the gate. And use the keys if you would like. I actually forget what those guys are associated with. I actually kind of forget. This is the one you want to open up with kids in it. So yeah, there we go. We talked to him, and now we gotta just meet him southwest of Paradise Falls. I don't know why dog meat's still freaking out because there's okay. <laughs> that's that's a sucky day, isn't it? So there's a few things over here. You can get some Nuka Colas. Yeah. Cool. And there's not really much else here. If you want, you can just kind of look through here real quick, Let's which is kind of what I'm doing. Um, yeah. He actually doesn't want to hurt you. That's the thing. I'm not even going to hurt him. I don't even feel like it. Dog meat, on the other hand, he can go rat, go whatever. He can do whatever he wants. I don't care. Because I actually want to attack him. He's not doing anything to me. Dog meat's going to destroy him, though. But, you know, whatever. I'm just going to watch it happen. Or I miss it. You know, whatever. Personally, yeah, he didn't have anything on him that's worthwhile. So that's why I left him go. Out of there, Mungo. So right here, you can meet this twice, kid. I actually, we didn't talk to him originally. So there we go. We completed uh, Rescue from Paradise. It was a little side quest so we could uh, continue on uh, with uh, picking up the trail. So now we can finally do back here at uh, Little Lamplight Caverns. Gates closed. We walked in. Mary McCready should talk to us, or we could talk to... What? Can't talk to him? What? There we go. You again? I guess you're okay. I... You can come in, but you better not. So I gotta worry about not pissing him off, because then he'll kick me out. But other than that, um. You can go and, uh. Hey, actually, you have to talk to Mayor McCready again, if I can find him again. Oh, he's still standing here, actually. monsters back here. What monsters? The big ones. He's talking about super mutants, if you yeah, ever wondered. I do. It's through Murder Pass. It's through Murder it's Pass. Really it's not go, a really safe way to go. Yeah. The, only the other door hasn't worked since before I was here. You sure about this? Come on. Okay, so you have to talk to Mayor McCready uh, to open the door to Murder Pass so you can get there. So pretty much just follow him and just go along with him. There's an optional thing he was saying about uh, his friend Joseph. He's kind of a computer guy in this game. Computer kid, I should say. He's a computer kid. And um, you can talk to him and he'll talk to you about, the, about something about a computer being busted. I actually never did it. I actually just kind of go through this place and do it myself. Because usually my science and stuff's pretty high at this point in the game. Pretty much follow him. Here's the gate. Um, so yeah. The gate. He'll walk up there and open it for us. You actually need p two people to open it. I didn't realize that the first time. But yeah, he opens it for us. And you can talk to him. And be like, yeah, thanks, man. Oh, actually, I can't. 
So I'm going here, and there's the door to murder pass, as the kids call it. They don't like it. There's super mutants in there. They're just saying, oh, we're just going to die if we go in there. Me, otherwise, no. I'm not too worried about it. Thing is, um, pull out your, if you have a missile launcher, I suggest pulling it out. And turn to the left here, and there's a super mutant with a missile launcher here. Actually, there's two of them. Wow. I didn't realize it the first time. Did I seriously just freaking miss him by, like, inches? But, yeah, they'll shoot missile... They have missile launchers, too, and, um, they'll shoot you with them. The last time I at least played against them, they had missile launchers. Maybe they don't... Oh, there it is. Never mind. Keep my words. There's a missile launcher I was talking about. Well, that, took, that was pretty smooth and simple. Kind of took him out pretty fast. Kind of shocked a little bit. Oh, I was just saying, I'm going to try to squeeze it through there. That didn't work. Shoot. I forgot this actually went down. Just goes to a dead end. With some ammo and stuff. I can't believe I didn't see that the first time. Sorry dog, man. I didn't mean to click on you there, bud. So yeah, we leveled up to level 13. Yeah, um, let's see here. Uh, repair. Well, repair my big guns. No, uh, raise up my big guns. Um, guess go up my medicine a little bit and repair and uh, I guess small guns. that get more health bonus when using stim packs uh, I like using stim packs a lot especially when I don't have food so um, yeah I think I'm gonna do that both things I hit the thing in my way Oh, there's another brood up there now. Fun. I'm wasting missiles, I just realized. <laughs> Got him. I gotta try to take out this big guy up here. Okay, maybe he disappeared. He might be coming the long way around, maybe. I just gotta be ready for him. Right over here, you're gonna find a super mutant and hide behind that thing. Just be ready to blast them. Actually, I'm gonna save up my missile launcher for right now. I'm actually gonna switch up to something else. I uh, just don't know what, really. Flamer question mark? Sure. Why not? Actually, I'm gonna use a skill box real quick. Okay, 
Okay, so we're making pretty quick work of this place, actually. It's actually not as taking as long as I thought. So we're kind of running through this place pretty fast, which is pretty good. <coughs> not gonna lie. So you're gonna want to make this turn right here and go through here. There was a sign back there that says this is not a part of the tour, and it's talking about whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, <laughs> I'm good now. But it's talking about uh, the vault, like it has a vault symbol on it. So yeah. <coughs> the only bad thing about this place is um. You get very close to um, running out of stem packs. As you can see, I'm getting kind of low right now. So maybe off camera I might go back and get some more before I continue on. Just an idea, though, but... Ooh, lots of, lots of first aid kits. Awesome. Cool. So, yeah. Actually getting some some stim packs back, so I'm um, not too bad now actually. Maybe I don't need to go now, but I'm probably still going to anyway. Just so, you know, you'll be good in the long run. Actually, I'm going to pick up this Super Mute and actually try to sleep here so I can save some health. Oh, huh, maybe I can't sleep here. I thought I could because that bed was there, but no, I guess not. Continuing on, um, uh, yeah, we're going to go through here. I was thinking about stopping the video, I can't, can't really say, but I was thinking about it, but then I just remembered that, that we're almost to the end, and I'm like, nah, let's just keep going. I didn't really want to make a super long video again, because I kind of regretted it. Like, do you want your marshmallows well done or just a little warm? <laughs> I think that Super Mute wanted them toasted. I'm sorry, that was a terrible joke. <laughs> I couldn't resist it, though. I really could not. But I'm um, opening this door. Um, walk in here, and there's actually a pressure plate right here. Now, you're going to want to disable that because if you don't, there... This grenade bouquet will drop and a bunch of grenades will blow up. So, um, yeah, you want to disable that before you get, uh, blown up. So, yeah. Because it won't turn out very well for you. You'll possibly die if you're pretty close to it. I'm trying to get real fast because I believe I'm over 20 minutes already. Trying to be a little fast with this. There's new Cola Quantum right there. So we're gonna open this door. We're just gonna walk through here. In the reactor chamber. There we go. Picking up the trail quest has now been completed. And now, in the next episode, we will be doing finding the Garden of Eden. So yeah, guys, in the next episode, we'll be doing, we'll start that quest. So yeah, guys, see you guys then.